Hey Lakewood Middle Schools, I'm Mrs. Hoy, librarian at Garfield. And I'm Mr. Costello from Harding. We're here to tell you about the summer reading assignment. This summer, it's going to be totally different and totally exciting. That's right. This summer, you have the choice of reading one graphic novel out of a choice of three. I feel like getting graphic. I'm feeling it. Let's, Let's get, get graphic! graphic. I can't wait for you to hear about these three books. Yeah, here are some Garfield and Harding students to tell you about them. Meet Jensen. This is a kid whose daydreams include video games where he's a hero saving his friends from the latest middle school disaster. But middle school reality is very different. Math is hard, getting along with friends is hard, even finding a partner for the class project is a huge problem when you always get picked last. Jensen has always played the middle school game one level at a time, but suddenly someone's cranked up the difficulty setting. Can Jensen make sense of all the middle school drama, or will he get stuck being bullied and hurt even worse by his friends? Find out in Brave. Emmy. She's super artistic, but a little on the quiet side. Okay, a lot on the quiet side. She's not bullied, but she feels almost invisible in middle school. Then there's Kate. She's athletic, popular, outgoing, and just naturally smells of rainbow goodness. They couldn't be more different, but their lives unexpectedly intersect one day when an embarrassing note falls into the wrong hands. How will Katie and Emmy deal with this drama? Be prepared to cringe at embarrassing moments and laugh out loud at all this middle school humor in Invisible Emmy. Meet Scott. He lives to play basketball. He's the guy scraping his chin, diving for every loose ball. He's the guy training every single day who steps up at every opportunity to take charge. Scott played for his high school team, but now he wants something so badly he's determined never to give up on it. Never. He wants to be a walk-on for Kansas University. He wants to be part of this winning college team, but he doesn't have the height like the other guys do. Plus, he has a horrible injury. Time is ticking and he's only got his senior year left. Can he make the team or will Kansas University force him to give up on his dream? What's the best part of this story? It's all true. So what do you think, Lakewood? You just heard about three awesome graphic novels. The hardest part for you now is to pick which one to read.